Natural selection is the gradual process by which heritable traits become either more or less common in a population as a result of any or all of the following items. Overpopulation, competition for resources, changes in the environment, and predators. There are three types of natural selection, directional, stabilizing, and disruptive. Directional selection occurs when one or two of a trait extremes are selected. A classic example is the pepper moth during the Industrial Revolution. In the mid-1800s, most pepper moths were white, and black pepper moths were rare to see. As the Industrial Revolution moved forward, factories were fueled by coal, and many of the trees became dark. By 1900, the population of pepper moths were mostly black. The black color on the dark tree was more favorable than the white color for the pepper moth. Stabilizing selection occurs when the environmental factor selects for the average of a trait. One example of the number of eggs a bird population lays. Many birds may lay two eggs, but this may not be enough for the birds to survive, and four eggs may be too many birds to feed. Over time, the population will stabilize around three eggs. Disruptive selection is the opposite of stabilizing. The average is not favorable and the extremes become favorable. For example, you have a population of rabbits that live along black and white rocks. The fur color of the rabbits range from white to gray to black. The white and black are the extreme colors. Because the white and black colors can camouflage on the white and black rocks, the extremes will be selected for and the average color will be selected against. Over time, this type of selection can lead to speciation. Thanks for watching and remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.